I can't believe I'm doing this video, but here we go again. COVID-19. An acute respiratory illness in humans caused by a coronavirus capable of producing severe symptoms and in some cases, death. Especially in older people and those with underlying health conditions, it was originally identified in China in 2019 and became pandemic in 2020. Well, this was interesting. I remember when COVID-19 came out publicly, it was around February. I was getting on a bus after school and one of my friends said, Hey Danny, we don't go to school until April. After he said that, my mind was I looked at my phone and looked up coronavirus and COVID was everywhere in my town. Everyone was getting sick. Everybody was staying home and I went home and we were all just talking about COVID-19 and just waiting. Months after months after months and nothing was changing. We all had to stay home. There was rarely any groceries coming in, no toilet paper and man, it was... It was sick back then. Now I can say that 2020 was actually the worst year in our generation history. But it wasn't looking pretty for 2021 for us. Okay, so let me explain how we caught COVID. I was at work and my girlfriend called me saying that someone at home has COVID-19. I won't say names, but let's just say they lived in the room next to me. I called my dad because he was at work as well and he was going home. I told him not to go home because somebody has COVID and you know what he said? Ah, no, I'm going home. I don't care who has COVID. I don't have COVID. I want to go home and lay down. Bye. And I said, well, it's your loss. And hung up. All day, I was just thinking if I should go home or not. I remember telling my girlfriend to leave the house and let's go to her mom's house. But, I mean, she was pregnant. Of course, she's not going to want to leave either. So I had to do a sacrifice on myself and take myself home. I got home and I felt the energy of COVID quick. We went days without getting sick until I worked morning shift. I got to work at 7.30 a.m. and I was working with three workers and one manager. I'm a manager myself, so it's um it's pretty cool to have a lot of people with me. Usually it's just supposed to be two managers working morning shift, but this day, this specific day, so many people were working. So I went in and I immediately got the runs. I went to the restroom and came out, got the runs again, went back to the restroom and came out again. So I decided to make myself a pizza, but something was a little off. I smelled the pizza, and I did not smell a single thing on the pizza. Ah, oh, yeah. This is where the loss of smell came in, people. I took a bite, and I couldn't taste a single thing. The rest of the workers started coming in, and I just stood quiet. Two hours later, I started feeling a fever and the urge to start puking. I called my general manager and told her if it's okay for me to leave. She said, who is working right now? Five other people. Hmm... Okay, make sure you let me know whenever you feel better. Yes, I got off the hook, and I went home and immediately went to bed. I lay down and told my girlfriend that I felt pretty weird. Guys, this COVID sickness is no joke. It's no conspiracy. It's no government plan. This sickness is so disgusting that I can't even remember how I felt. Now, let's go to the 14 days of being sick. Day number one, no taste, no smell, no nothing like that. Day number two. Pain within my body and arms whenever I feel cold. Day number three, lots and lots of headaches. Day number four, five, six, lots and lots of coughs and puking. Had dizziness and literally couldn't walk. Day number seven, eight, nine, losing my breath from my cough, literally almost dying. I could have died. I really could have died. But luckily, I found this video where this person shows how to get your air back from COVID. Please, please do me a favor and check out that video, please. Day number 10, 11 to 12. No more dizziness, no more coughs, no more feeling sick, but I did have headaches. Went outside for the first time and it seemed like I haven't seen the outside for a very long time. Day number 13 and 14, working with myself for recovery. Finally was able to eat, finally was able to sit up and enjoyed a meal. Going towards recovery, you will experience a lot of cravings. Do not look at Mexican food, people. And yeah, there you go. A few weeks ago, I caught COVID again, but I didn't feel any symptoms, so I think my white cells are working in my body. I forgot to mention that during COVID, I lost a lot of weight. So for people who want to lose weight, just grab a cup of COVID and drink it. That was a joke. Don't get COVID. Don't ever get COVID. This is my experience, my explanation, and how I got COVID. Alrighty, that's it. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys need any tips on having COVID and how to feel better, just drink water and Tylenol. Water and Tylenol, I will repeat. 
you will literally feel better if you guys need anything else just leave a comment below let me know what's your experience with COVID-19 and thanks for watching again and I'll see you guys later the fuck was that man